June 11, Tuesday Memorial of St. Barnabas, Apostle A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew Jesus said to the twelve, As you go, make this proclamation. The kingdom of heaven is at hand. Cure the sick, raise the dead, cleanse lepers, drive out demons. Without cost, you have received. Without cost, you are to give. Do not take gold or silver or copper for your belts, no sack for the journey, or a second tunic, or sandals, or walking stick. The laborer deserves his keep. Whatever town or village you enter, look for a worthy person in it, and stay there until you leave. As you enter a house, wish it peace. If the house is worthy, let your peace come upon it. If not, let your peace return to you. The Gospel of the Lord The kingdom of heaven is at hand. When Jesus instructs the twelve to proclaim the nearness of God's kingdom, he echoes the preaching of John the Baptist and his own earlier proclamation. What is preached is not impending judgment but the kingdom that is touching people now. In lieu of twelve tribes of Israel, Jesus chose the twelve, who are sent to the lost sheep of the house of Israel. They will act as instruments of the gracious God, allowing the people to touch God's kingdom by their ministry of preaching, healing, and exorcising evil spirits. Their meager provisions will demonstrate to people their selflessness and trust in divine providence. They are not to make any claim in exchange of their service, nor should they entertain a sense of self-entitlement. They are to be bringers of peace, God's shalom. But when rejected, they should not respond with condemnation or desired retribution. The twelve rely on the generosity and graciousness of God. Do we see God in the same light? Or do we think of our Heavenly Father as uncaring and miserly?